Peace out. Okay, today's wisdom from the hammock. <clears throat> Just had lunch, let me check my teeth. Okay, just kidding. Um, whew, so I just got off of a two hour call with three of the most powerful fucking people I know in my life. Rich Lippin, Marilyn Rodriguez, and Stacy Nelson. And me. So four of the most powerful people I know in my life. And um, we're all coaches. Um... And we're all souls living this human experience. And I, I'm going to have takeaways bubbling up for a while. But one of them is that we're all just human. We're all just real people living this life and going about this work. And their sun is shining in my eye. We're all just people <clears throat> with um, human tenderness and sensitivities and worries and and yes we are absolutely powerful and you guys we as people have just got to quit comparing ourselves we have got to quit measuring ourselves at all measuring ourselves against or up up against anybody um we have got to quit worrying about that. We have got to quit worrying about how can I become this or become that. And we have got to start living a little bit more in the moment and just being who and where we are now and finding joy in that. <clears throat> and um, wherever you are, if you're out there trying to compare your light or your heart or your life to somebody else's, you're always going to feel like shit. I used to think I invented the quote, comparison is the thief of joy, but I found out that Benjamin Franklin also said it and clearly he lived before I did. But I still think and believe that comparison is the thief of joy. And so if you're waking up and feeling no joy, which is a problem, no joy is a problem. If you're waking up feeling no joy, then you need to stop fucking comparing yourself to somebody else. That's my wisdom for the day. I love you. Mwah.